A low-income housing facility for the elderly and disabled held its first ever art show tonight. ABC 17's Marina Diaz is live from Paquin Towers in downtown Columbia. Marina, a local church, helped host Paquin Towers' first ever Talent at the Tower. Marissa, I saw artwork from some of the lovely residents here at Paquin Towers. I also found out after speaking to some of those residents how donations from events like this can benefit those living here. My heart overwhelms. My heart just overwhelms because I work with these residents as a volunteer. I hear what they say that they think that people see them as. Chief volunteer for the Christ Lutheran Church, Carol Thompson, hosts art class with the residents of Paquin Tower and is responsible for creating Paquin Tower's first ever talent at the tower. I think the members of the residents see the opportunity to do art as us, people of the community, saying, yeah, we think you're just one of us and we recognize you as that and we care. Resident and artist Debbie Richardson says the event has a lasting impact on the residents of Paquin. It's humbling, really. And it's, I mean, it's, you think these people, they don't know us. And it's just makes you feel like you're somebody. Paquin Towers is a low-income housing facility operated by the Columbia Housing Association. The ADA Accessible Building has 200 units designated for people with disabilities and seniors aged 55 and older. Families pay 30% of their adjusted household income for rent. Pastor Tim Morrison told me he hopes the event today will raise awareness for the residents living here. 200 plus residents who live here and um, and so um, I hope that, A, they find out a little bit more about what goes on at Paquin and then find other ways to join and volunteer and to help out, to make their life even better. Marissa, admission to today's event were canned goods and personal hygiene products and cash donations if people were feeling up to it and all of those will be going to benefit those residents living here. Reporting live in Columbia, Marina Diaz, ABC 17 News. Marina, thank you so much for that. The Columbia Housing Association provides housing assistance to more than 1,900 families in Columbia and Boone County.